it's the energy vibration reading for um the capricorn sun moon horizon sign okay you capis Alrighty, you campies, let's see what's out there with the Capricorn Sun Moon Horizon sign. This is the first reading of the month of the year 2019, and I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you. I love you, Capri, so much. Let's see what is happening for you, Capricorns. This year is a year of water, and the first month it is judgment, okay? Um, for the year energies it's judgment so for you Capricorns let's see what energy vibration you Capricorns are going to be working with <laughs> you Cap has got the energies of the star so you Cap is you have the energy of the star for the month of January 2000 and um, 19 and I want to say Please like, share these videos, thumbs up. Remember that this reading is always 45 minutes long, and you can re receive the energy of the extended reading on the moon. So that is going to be good. This is going to be wonderful. Let's see what's happening for you, Capis. Oh, let's see what's happening for you, Capis. Um, you have the energy of the star. Two first weeks is going to be your own zodiac energy vibration. As we go to the two and a half last weeks, it's going to be here energy. So they're calling in the angels and the guides for the Capricorn, Sun, Moon, and Horizon. Let's see what's coming up for the Capis. Okay, you Capis are dealing with the organization in the first week. Okay, there is some investigation is being done. Um, there is research that is being done with organization. It could be that you are um, having to do with work, um, you're applying for work or jobs, that sort of a thing with this organization. You, uh, This organization could be helping you also. Okay. All right. So let's see what else is coming up for the Capricorns in the second week. We have um, the Four of Pentacles. So uh, it could be some of you are dealing with an organization uh, applying for um, some financial help or that sort of a thing or dealing with a financial situation with this organization alrighty oh this is a new card the eight of Pentacles so obviously it's all about work you Capricorns are going to be having some situation to do with work um, um, in an organization some um, uh, so um, it's an earth sign you begin so you have earth 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 energies and this is going to be good for you cap is all the three weeks until the energies change it's all about um, work some of you could be building your your own um, company or you, some of you could be a self-employed for uh, and building your your own companies um, that sort of thing let's see what's happening in the four weeks for the Capricorns you have you have to find inner strength in the fourth week um, not bad because it could be that you have a lot of work to do because you are hard at work what's happening for the Capricorn Sun Moon Horizon in um, the fifth week of January what's happening for the Capricorn fifth week of January you have the end of the situation and a new beginning so this is good Oh uh, my God, Cap is you rock. I'm seeing that you Capricorns are going to have a good, good year because you start and you have the year with the energy of the star coming out for you Capricorns. And um, as I see this layout, you have the Aerophant, which is an organization. This is Taurus is coming in also to help you. Um, you could be in an organization working, searching for something. Some of you could be deciding to do taxes. It's all about work, work, work. In the third week, you're busy, busy doing work. Um, inner strength comes in, but the strength is because you have so much to do. End of a situation, positive new beginning is about to take place. So you have um, first week, second week, third week. It's all about the earth energy. Fourth week, it, it, you find inner strength because the changing of the zodiac of the hair energy. And you end with the world cap is so okay let's see what is happening for you Capricorns so um, what is the situation with this organization and the four of Pentacles 
what is the situation with the organization and the four of pentacles you need to find balance so you're going to be working out a situation with an organization with a financial situation in the first and second week okay you need to find balance is as if you're balancing out the situation with an organization in the first and second week and that is good second week going in the third week for so the Capricorn for the year of January what's happening oh my god you have the energy of the Empress God girl you're about to hit it off are you on the islands oh my god vacation <laughs> but it is the energy of the Empress so this is going to be good because what is this is saying is another major arcana that is coming up this is your own energy vibration so the um, uh, second week going in the um, the second week going in the third week it's uh, the work is bringing in a lot of abundancy for you some of you you have the six of swords so work 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 and um, you decide um, to find the strength to do something to move forward to do something you're moving um, and you make a decision to make a move and this is good and then you have the energy of the six of Pentacles helps it's going to be coming in for you copies okay so this is good um, um, help is going to be coming in you could be helping out other people you are moving on on a positive new direction and in the fourth week help is going to be coming in for you so this is going to be wonderful it's, it's not a bad week at least you make a decision to make a move and this is good so temperance with the Empress is a lot of major autonomous that is helping you cap this out so this is good so the Empress the temperance is here with the Empress what is this saying what is this saying the hardship some of you are feeling as if you're in hardship whatever the, the situation is some of you are feeling as if you're in hardship but it's as if um, as you know the, the the angels are saying no don't don't look at it that way um, what you're seeing in front of you is not really what is happening okay so let's see what is happening the eight of Pentacles what is this energy that is coming up the eight of Pentacles would work and um, you're going to be working together you're going to be networking you're going to be working together so this is good some of you could be um, going to connect with the Virgos you're working together um, the Knight of Wands is here so you're having strength to deal with someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius you could be working with him or he could be coming in to help you out of a situation so the Knight of Wands is as if he's going to be coming in yeah to help you out of a situation okay now we have the five of Pentacles and the three of Pentacles what is this um, the eight of cups you're thinking about leaving and turning your back on the situation whatever that is transpiring you're thinking about uh, maybe it's too much work or um, maybe it's a network that is not making that you are not having enough with but this is like stay in there for the long run just stay in there for the long run okay okay what is happening with the three of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands, the Three of Pentacles, and the Knight of Wands. You're going to be victorious and successful over this situation. You are going to be victorious and successful over whatever that is happening and transpiring. This is good, you Capis. Wow, this is a beautiful reading. Honestly, wonderful reading. So much major arcana. You feel out in the cold, but it's as if. You know it, it takes time it takes time you feel out in the cold but it it is just take time so some of you are going to decide to turn your back on the situation and it could be a, uh, turning your back on being alone and connecting and networking and this is going to be working okay so what is the outcomes for the Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising what is the outcomes for the Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising oh 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 Ow, ow. Wow. Wow. Can you see this, guys? Can you see this? Are you seeing this, guys? Really? Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So, mm -mm -mm. 
This is a beautiful reading, you Capricorns. Number 66 is going to have an effect on you Capricorns. You have three times six, two times eight. Yeah, two times eight, three sixes and two eight is you Cappies. Isn't that beautiful? Yes, it is Cappies. So you Capricorn, oh my God, it's going to be a wonderful month, you Capricorns. And at the end of the month, uh, week five, you have your own energy vibration and what is looking at you a new start a new start so you cappies hey you're gonna be having a new start with work okay um, you're gonna be um, at the end of the month you're going to be having a new start in a new job um, or your business or you're going to be starting your uh, a new business but work is here okay um, the five of Pentacles keeps on coming up and the five of Pentacles is always hardship because here I'm seeing you an organization with money you could be helping an organization to find something um yeah you could be helping an organization to find something so if you're an accountant or a bookkeeper or um, that sort of a thing you could be finding an a, 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 a government institute or organization could be calling up on you and asking you um, to do a project for them to find some something that is find some money or to yes to find some money but it has nothing to do with you it has to do with um, it says if um, a company or um, maybe the tax company is going to call upon you and say hey um, we know you you know you're in that field is it possible you could help us um, with taxes or so and you have a fee but whatever you're you're about to do and whatever this organization is going to be asking you to do you're going to be doing it but it's something that you like to do okay for some of you so if you're an accountant or a bookkeeping you might be a, a receiving an offer from an organization to go work with them do it because I'm seeing this is going to be opening up some doors for you so do it now for you Capricorns it's going to be a positive month because what is transpiring is that the Empress is here the Empress is working together and networking and by this working together and networking what is going to happen is that some of you could be deciding to change your career and move out in another direction and that's just some of you could be deciding to change your career and move out in another direction okay so there's a lot in the, um, of information in this reading. You have three times six and two times eight. So money is going to be not a problem. Um, eight, um, the eight of um, pentacles and the eight of cups is going to be good. The energy of the world is here. The six of pentacles is here. Um, in, in the middle of your month is about networking. It's about connecting and networking. So let's see um, what is going on. It's about connecting, networking, that sort of a thing um, that is happening. Okay. Um, so let's see what's coming up for the Cappy on email spirit guides. And we are also working with the C, the um, series. Okay. We're also working with series. So that is good. So let's see. This is a general reading. Um, so if you'd like to personalize reading because it's your birthday, some of you Capricorns have already had birthday, happy belated birthdays. So let's see what's coming up for the Capricorns. Wow, this is a beauty one. The alchemy. Yes, Capricorns, you are about to change iron into gold or silver into gold. You are the alchemist, you Capri, and you're about to make that change. It is the month of you becoming the alchemist in your life, you Capri. You're changing something, okay? The alchemist has the energy of uh, a 10 and 4, 14. 
okay and that is one once star seed at experience and understand the true significance of transformation from one state of being to another he or she explore the alchemy process of the transmutation whereby elements are combined to create new forms oh my god I love you Kathy so much so this is what is about to happen for you Kathy's in the month of January you're going to be changing um, the form of situations in your life now I have two cards you Kathy's you need to choose one and this is the first one and this is the second one if you choose the first one it is the ego spirit spirit has your back it is the ego spirit spirit have your back and it is the number 23 you copies so this is so wonderful congratulations if you choose card one if you choose card um, three is chameleon act as if act as if so take on the energies uh, um, around you and act as if everything will work out positive for you so you have the number four so angels that is what number four is um, no five um, you know there are huge organization and powerful people that have your back eagle have your uh, eagle have your back spirit has your back okay and the chameleon is act as if and this is good wonderful reading you Capricorns you really really needed to start the year like this because I don't know about you Capricorns but I did not like to I was in the 18 yeah mm -mm. nope so we're going on to look at the the, the um, extended reading so let's go in this thank you so this is the extended week. So, Cappies, I'm happy for you, Cappies. Let's see what's happening. So, some Capricorns is dealing with to find balance in the organization with a financial situation. What is this all about? Some luck is going to be coming into you. 